Hello YouTubers. I'm kind of hoping somebody might be able to help me out with a little troubleshooting on my Mesa Boogie Transatlantic TA30 uh, 2x12 combo. As you'll see I've got uh, a number of different switching issues and sound issues so let's get started. Starting off here we're on channel 1. British, uh, top boost on um, and with a pull master, master cut on and, the, and, the, and we're on the, the 30 watch channel. So. <laughs> And there we have a sweet sounding amp, like it's supposed to be. Awesome sounds, uh, working great. Now, if we uh, foot switch it to uh, channel 2, in this case we're on tweed, 30 watts. Still works fine, still sounds good. Switching back, if I pull the foot switch, and channel switch it, and cuts out intermittently. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, a lot of, lot of, lot of buzz, a lot of hum. Oh, now the foot switch is not working. Oh, sorry, no, wait a minute, we're in there. So this, now, now, now we get to the second kind of weird problem. If we're running quite a bit of distortion on the uh, channel 1 British top boost uh, channel and we have quite a loud signal, st signal strength when we, uh, when we channel switch you get kind of a weird swell or, um, or echo in the, in the reverb after the channel switching and once again on the, the foot switch the basic noise level of the amp is much higher. Okay, next problem. We've been playing on uh, on 30 watts, changing to uh, 15. Amp dies. Changing to uh, 40 watts, same again. So it's only working on the 30 watt, 30 watt mode. There's that swell again, and once again, 30 watts on the on the on the second channel doesn't work on 15 watts. Doesn't work on 40 watts. The uh, the two high gain modes work fine. So if anyone's got some, got some suggestions, it would I'd be I'd appreciate the help. Um, I've gone through the systematic um, uh, tube replacement pr procedure, buying brand new, a brand new uh, preamp tube and replacing it systematically one at a time through each of the posi positions of preamp tubes. And I also purchased a, a new pair of uh, power amp tubes and also replaced systematically one pair at a time. It doesn't seem to be a tube issue. There's no, there was no change in the behavior changing, changing uh, tubes. So if anyone's got any suggestions, I'd appreciate it. Thanks very much.